a spiritual writer said, if you cannot hear the voice of God, you have to turn down the world's volume. Why is it so difficult nowadays to hear and listen to the voice of God? It is because the world today is already very noisy and too loud. In today's gospel, Jesus said, My sheep hear my voice. I know them. They follow me. The Jews who asked for clarification did not understand Jesus because they were not part of his flock. If only they are part of his flock, they will hear and understand his words. Kinaiya sa mga karnero nga makaila sa tingog sa ilang magbalantay. In Israel, ang mga karnero nga gibantayan og lain-laing mga magbalantay sometimes will mix with other sheep in a place. And how will the shepherd know his sheep in the midst of other sheep? The shepherd uses his voice to call his own sheep to him. And the sheep who hears the voice of their shepherd will go towards the source of the voice. Ang mga karnero makailaman sa tingog sa ilang magbalantay o ginigtawag sa magbalantay sa iyang panun sa mga karnero, musunod sila kaniya. Ug samtang ang ubang mga karnero nga dili iya, dili usab musunod kaniya. And this is the imagery that Jesus used to tell the Jews why they cannot understand him and his teachings. The reason is simply this, they are not his sheep. They won't recognize his voice. How about us? If we claim to be Jesus' followers, if we are truly his flock, shouldn't we be able to hear the voice of our shepherd? In our present time, there are so many voices in our world, and it is one of the reasons why many of us have a difficulty in hearing and listening to the voice of Jesus, our good shepherd. The noisiest among them comes from gadgets and social media. Every now and then, there are many notifications that we receive. And if we read all of them, it will take most of our time and thus lessen our time for prayer and reflection. Another distracting noise today is the content of those that we read, watch, those that we listen to and interact with. There are messages of anger, violence, intrigue, misleading information, greed, worldly desire, and pleasure. The world has become very noisy, and this explains why we can no longer hear the voice of God today. If we, the sheep, could not hear the voice of the Good Shepherd anymore, we may get lost and wander in dangerous paths. How can we follow the Lord Jesus, our Good Shepherd? One way in following the Lord is to hear His Word. The Word of God is the food for our soul that will give us eternal life. Every day we celebrate the Holy Mass, we hear God's Word proclaimed to us, we listen to the reflection and deepening of the Word in the homily. Do we open ourselves to the inspiration of the Spirit leading us towards conversion and transformation of our life? In the midst of our busy day, do we find time, do we devote time to prayer as an opportunity to dialogue with Jesus, our Good Shepherd? Brothers and sisters, our Lord Jesus today invites us to indeed turn down the volume of our world so that we can hear His voice more, so that we can follow Him wholeheartedly and live sincerely as good Christians and upright citizens. My sheep hear my voice. I know them and they follow me. Amen.